Dawn was just, just barely 62. We had just spent one glorious winter, our first winter together in Florida as a retired couple. And he developed some back pain while we were there. And after many, many doctor's visits and you know, the whole routine, they, de they discovered some tumors in his, um, in his spinal area. The first thing I did was call everybody and anyone I knew, and we got out to Dana Faber, who were awesome in seeing us immediately. They immediately put a whole team together and confirmed the diagnosis, first of all, and then began, um, then we began an odyssey of two years. The grief upon losing my husband was, is indescribable, insurmountable, the most painful thing I've ever experienced in my life. Dawn and I had met when we were 16 years old. We were high school sweethearts. We survived separations during college. Um, Vietnam, he was a Vietnam veteran. We had our own share of breakups and by the time we married, we thought we were old, we were 24. We were thought we were o so old. Um, we waited nine years to have children and then raised our family together. I had not had a thought, made a plan, set a goal without him being involved for the past 50 years. And all of a sudden, I was alone. The crying, I didn't think there were that many tears in me. I cry, and when I cried, the tears just flowed. I, I felt like I had a knife in my heart. I think now, 18 months later, they come not quite as often, sometimes not quite as deeply, uh, but they still come. They still come because I still miss my other half, my better half. When I first talked to Sue Morris, the head of the grief counseling group at Dana-Farber, she encouraged me to come in for an individual meeting and explained to me that this was something that Dana-Farber offered. I had never heard of it before. I, didn't, I wasn't aware of the program. Sue also mentioned that she ran group sessions, which I didn't feel I had an interest in. But I came in and I met Sue, and I found our individual session very, very helpful. And she told me about a group that she would be running. She explained to me that it would be all people who have lost spouses, which I felt was really important because that's, that's, a, that's a special, different kind of loss. So I went to my first group and probably went through half a box of tissues. Uh, I found it very difficult to even say Dawn's name without breaking down into tears. The interesting thing was I wasn't the only one there who was having the same problem. Everybody had such a unique story, a unique love story, and we were all suffering. It, it was my lifeline. It was my lifeline. These were people who got it. They really knew what I felt. I can't praise the program enough, and I can't praise Sue Morris enough for her guidance, her support, her tender prodding. We have a beautiful video uh, montage with some of Dawn and my favorite songs and all the pictures from age 16 to 60 something. Um, and I just watched it the other day and it was the first time I didn't break down and sob through the entire thing. I was able to listen to the words of the music. I was able to look at the pictures and look at my handsome husband and appreciate the life that we did have.